Well, hello everyone and welcome back to Subsistence Land. So, okay, all right. <clears throat> Chain. Oh, there's excitement happening. Uh, change of plans. Um, we were going to try and go down to the cave today. And I do still want to do that eventually, but I've got a bit of a problem. And that problem is, uh, so, you know, that <laughs> like many things, you sort of think about what you're going to do. By the way, I'm going to eat uh, one of you. Oh, yeah. Oh, that. look at that. Oh, it's so good. And maybe even have one of you. There we are. Um, so like many like many things, you sort of have time to think about stuff. And, and I had some good comments in the comment fields. And one of the things that I realized is, well, okay, let's take a look at something. So this right here is my immer is my uh, dive station and you'll notice that I have something here this is a spare dive rig why do I have a spare dive rig I have a spare because if I die in the cave I need to be able to spawn on the bed come over here grab some uh, various weapons I've got a 44 I've got an SVT we've got tons of stuff here I've got a bow with some arrows I've got spare uh, you know, bandages and all of the, you know, some clothing. I've got everything I need, a bit of food, to be able to get back up to speed so I can get down into the cave as quickly as possible and recover my stuff. Because there is a timer on your death bag, right? Otherwise, you lose all your glorious things, all your thing. A level four bow, a level three lever action rifle. Yeah, potentially gone. Well, if we think about it... Um, there is, in addition to the uh, the dive gear, um, yeah, I'm going to need a spare set of climbing axes. Because if I die in the lava area, I need climbing axes to get down into the lava area to be able to recover my bag. So, yeah, I need to make a spare set of climbing axes. <laughs> and here's here's the thing. If we take a look at what it takes to make climbing axes, we will see that it is eight ingots. And 150 mass. Now, the power I can do. Uh, do we have enough crystal? We certainly do have enough crystal. Good. Uh, hang on a sec. There we go. Okay. Um, but I don't have eight ingots. Now, to make ingots, I'm going to need... Uh, well, I've got... I'm going to have everything I need. So, we're going to start on this right now. But uh, I'm going to have everything I need material-wise. But I don't have everything I need mass-wise. So, we're going to need to start cranking out mass. Oh, so I do apologize, but we are it is going to take a little bit longer to get down into the cave than I, I had expected. Now, there is a couple of other things that... How's this fuel level? It's good. Okay. There's a couple of other things that we need to, to think about. Oh, these are almost... These are full. Okay, I already did that. All right. Uh, you can go on, and you can go on, and you can go on. There you go. And then we can flick you on, because we're going to need to generate mass. Oh, really? <laughs> oh, seriously? <laughs> Come on, up we go. Where are you? Where is he? Oh, there he is. There he is. Oh, it's Alpha, of course. That's right. Is he shooting me with a shotgun from way over there? You're a bit weird. He's gonna... Oh, Molotov. Oh, no, grenade. Come on. Let's see if we can... Oh! Nope, that's not gonna happen. Are you running away? Oh, no. Oh, no. The problem is that... Ah, oh, come on. You, you gotta stop moving at some point. Oh, there you go. Oh! Ho, 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 ho. Oh, he dodged it! Did you see that? Oh! Oh, you jerk! You total jerk! Oh, yeah. No, there he goes. Well, that's okay. That's okay. He's done. <laughs> Goodbye. Was there... Oh, there was two of them. Where was the other guy? Ah, all right. Well, we'll have to check out what kind of damage the... Uh, actually, let's go down this way uh, later. We're going to check out maybe whether they did anything. It. This base is pretty resilient. I mean, look, that one's got a bit of damage, but it's okay. 
Uh, anyways, so where were we? Ah, yes. Uh, we were generating... Ooh. Out and in. Oh, out. Oh, in is way too much. That's better. That's better. Uh, we would have basically hit 3,500 and then the generators would have shut off, but the uh, mass fabricator wouldn't, and then my power would have started going... <laughs> Um, all right, so I think what we'll do, by the way, is uh, hmm, I need to think about where I'm going to stick. No, well, no. How about it? Yeah, okay, we're going to do it here. So this is going to be this second row down is going to be our uh, gear for the thing. So we're not going to do the cave today. That's the moral of the story. And the reason is, as I say, uh, I don't want... If I die in the lava area, I need to be able to recover my stuff. Oh, some people had um, actually some great feedback. And one of those bits of feedback... You know, let's do this. And we'll put that in there like that. And then we're going to grab... Well, we're going to grab all the mass that we've been accumulating. <laughs> oh, and also, let's put uh, you in there. And yeah, the rest of this will be fine. Yeah, it'll be fine. Okay, well, what am I doing? Oh yeah, mass, 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 mass. We need all of the mass. Because uh, it's not just the ingots. I need 150 mass after I make the ingots. I need 80 mass for the ingots, 150 mass for the, the climbing axes. Y you get the... <laughs> I need a lot of mass. <laughs> I need all of it. Every bit of the mass. <laughs> Every, everything. <laughs> oh, we're getting there. We're getting there. Yes, because what is that? Uh, 150 plus 80 is 230. So we'll get there. We'll get there. Okay. Oh, all right. We need copper and uh, we need uh, iron because we're going to need to make... Uh, well, we're going to make... We need uh, at least seven of these, but I think I'll just make the eight. Uh, and the reason why is that's what... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight... Uh, because then I'd have, at least I have a spare ingot kicking around just in case I need to do something ingoty, <laughs> you know, like ingot related. <laughs> uh, what else do we need in order to make the spare climbing axis? We're going to need, um, oh, how's, uh, 150? I think we can turn the uh, mass fabricator off now. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I think that will be fine. Now, in order to make... We also need uh, 12 crystal and 8 scrap. Oh, the scrap hurts. The scrap really does hurt. Uh, uh, yeah, 12 crystal. We're going to have to get crystal while we're in the cave. It, we're not going to focus on... It's not going to be like normal where we focus on getting, um, the, getting crystal and coal. We're going to, like... It'll be crystal and coal of opportunity. But, yeah, that's... That's not going to be the main focus. All right, so we're going to let those cook off. We're going to keep you here so we can make another climbing axe. Ah, now, some other bits of feedback. And, like, it's great because I had a lot of similar thoughts. Um, one of the things I was warned about is that I'm going to go through a lot of water. Oh, I heard something in the subsistence. Uh, I saw something in the subsistence discord. I want to check something out. Um, okay. Okay. Let's do this, and let's split this in half, and let's just, you know, pop that in there. We have 30. Now let's see what happens. Aha! Uh -huh. he, he capped the max bottle uh, stack to 40. <laughs> yeah, so there's a change. That's a, that is a change. And I think there are some other stack limits that have been changed as well. Now, it doesn't if affect uh, uh, current stacks, but it does cap the... Um, if you want to make a new stack. So that's good to know. Um, the other thing is that, yeah, we don't need those two tomatoes. Uh, I have berry water. I have that. I probably would be, be uh, better off taking um, even a full stack of tomatoes as opposed to just the two. Um, we could take the jam, but uh, fruits and vegetables is 70. How much is one tomato? It's 22. That's a lot. We could take the, uh, we could take our jam. Don't forget, I have an FOB down in the, uh, in the cave, so I can store stuff there. I won't be bringing everything with me. Um, I definitely won't need to take the, uh, the insect repellent into the cave. 
So we can we can maybe put that somewhere else like oh, I don't know I think I keep stuff like that in here uh, with the honey, which I don't have right now But we could put it there Because that's like where the other fixins go for when I make that kind of stuff um, Let's see splints. I need to take arrows. I'm definitely gonna take protein bars. I'm definitely gonna take in fact um, just to just so that we're, we're completely comfortable. I'm gonna take 50. I'm taking 50 of them LR rounds I think we're good on everything else. It's just a matter of, yeah, okay. Now, let's grab you, and if we go to that, and we go, oh yeah, spare, spare climbing axes. <laughs> oh my goodness. Now, I, w I, I have to, okay, we're gonna check something out. Uh, now, uh, I could go down now, but the thing is that I don't wanna go down in the middle of the day. Um, can I put this here? Oh, I can! Excellent. So this is my emergency diving recovery equipment right here. Okay, good, 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 good. So we have that. Um, now, climbing axe spare, right? We have the one we, we're going to take down with us. Um, bandages are at five. So we need to make a few more bandages. So we're going to make, uh, what do we have, ten? Ten. I don't think I need that much cloth. I think that's that's probably... Yeah, that'll be fine. Okay. Uh, there we go. Uh, we've got enough health kits. So, spare climbing axe. Oh, pickaxes. Yes, we're going to need spare pickaxes. Um, the pickaxe... Oh, man, this is more scrap. Uh, four, four, and two. So, four boards. Okay, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And one, two. And that'll make one pickaxe. Do I want to make another one? Yeah. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. This is really, this is really like making me super nervous. I'm, I'm really not, I'm not, I'm not feeling at all comfortable with this level of scrap. So we're going to actually go out and do a bit of looting uh, as well. I just, I need to do it. I need to get at least a little bit of scrap. Um, probably a bit of wood too. Yeah. Actually, let's put uh, this, this. I always have these on me, so I'll keep that anyways. Have that there, and then we're going to have a couple of spare pickaxes. So um, this is kind of my going away kit, and I think I think that's going to be good. That's going to be good. All right, how's power doing? Power is at 1,600, mass is at 1,100, 11. Okay. So, I think we're, we're ready to go. We can go down, but, um, yeah, the problem is that uh, if I go down now... Okay, why... I'll tell you what, let's go out and do some looting and I'll explain. Uh, yeah, sorry about that. I, I got myself all excited about going. And, yeah, now we're not going to. Oh, you know what I should do is I should... Before, if I'm going to go out, we're just going to take that just, just in case we run into something. Okay, I think we're all in good shape. Uh, all right, let's go. <clears throat> Let's go. <gasps> Ooh, stuff's grown. Excellent. Do, do, do. You know what? I just used a lot of copper. Oh, look, there's the wiggly. The wiggle. See, he changed it so it wiggles now. Oh, that's kind of cool. <laughs> it kind of makes it a little bit more exciting to get the ores. <laughs> I like that. That's awesome. Okay. Uh, let's go. Let's get some stuff. Uh, there is a building crate over here, which is probably going to have scrap. I'm going to... Oh, it wiggle. Wiggle. One scrap. Okay, it's a start. It's a start. Oh, that is... That is actually really, uh, really quite nice. Do, 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 do. All right, so why am I not going down today, even though I just, I now have everything I need to get down there? Um, because I want it to take a full day, and, okay, if I, the problem is that there's a respawn on the, uh, on the hunters, okay? So if you go down, uh, that's what I was looking for. You know what, let's go that way. Yeah, we don't go that way enough. Let's go this way. 
Uh, there is a respawn timer on the uh, like. There's a there's a respawn event in the um, uh, for the hunters. Okay, and it's essentially in the evening time. Now, some people say it's at midnight. Uh, I don't. I'm gonna get in trouble for this probably, um, but I, I'm not gonna. I'm, I'm gonna mitigate it by saying because uh, I'm gonna say I'm not really. I don't feel too strongly about it. You know what, buddy? You know what? Uh, that. Am I going to be able to get away with, uh... Oh, yeah, I am. Uh... <laughs> uh... Okay. <laughs> Let's just get this bear and this stuff taken care of. Uh... So, they, uh... I, I don't think that, um... Oh, look at the blood. <laughs> uh... Oh, scrap. Good. I don't think that, uh... That it's at, at midnight. I think it's a little bit earlier than midnight. Um, I think it it's basically after dark. Um, it may be that it it might even be a little later than it used to be, but I'm pretty sure because we used to do that a lot in the co-op game, um, and also over the years in single player, I've raced against darkness, uh, going after multiple bases before, and uh, in the old days, in in the old days back when subsistence was just a glimmer in cold games. No, I'm kidding. Um, back in the old days, uh, they used to, uh, we, we used to, uh, the, the building, the front door would, uh, reappear. It would rebuild itself. Like now, as was demonstrated over the last few days, uh, it doesn't do that. If you, if you go into a, uh, a, a, a base and you break down the front door and you're hanging out in the base when the respawn occurs, uh, it will, uh, the, it won't put the, a new front door into the base. So that's fine, right? Um, but we used to have to be a lot more attuned to that time in the, in, uh, prior in the old days, because what could happen is you could be, uh, breaking into a base and, uh, all of a sudden the door that you're breaking down that you're just about to smack through would all of a sudden go back to full health. And yeah, that there's nothing quite as frustrating as that. Or you'd break down a door. I need scrap. You know what? Let's just wander this way and see what we can find. Um, or you'd break down a door, you'd get inside the base, you'd start clearing it out, and then you'd turn around, and before you could get back out again, the door would appear behind you. And unless you're willing to jump off the balcony, uh, you basically were kind of trapped in the base. So, yeah, you'd have to either break your way out by chopping through it, which... I don't think we had um, tool damage, so that wasn't such a big deal. It was more time than anything else. It just took time. Um, now it takes tool damage, so of course you could end up stuck in a base, trapped in a base, and <laughs> with <laughs> with no tools because you break all your tools, and then what? Hey, look, there's a lock crate. Yeah, nice. Um, <laughs> and, and now you could now, then you'd have to definitely but then you'd, it doesn't matter anymore because the door doesn't reappear so it, it kind of you know six of one half dozen of the other right it ends up with the same result you can get out of the base um, yeah uh, so anyways so the point is wh where am I going with all of that why am I bringing all that up well I'm bringing that up because uh, in the cave there's rogues the rogues the rogue bases will respawn while you're in the cave, okay? And it, uh, that means that uh, what could happen is while I'm running through the cave, while I'm in the lava cave, all of a sudden I could have a rogue camp spawn in right next to me. I could end up being all of a sudden surrounded by rogues. Now, I, I don't know. I think I've demonstrated... Uh, a little bit that I don't mind taking some risks. I don't like. I'm not completely risk averse. I, I'll I'll do some weird crap, right? And uh, you know, play a bit of an aggressive game sometimes, just for fun. Um, you know, making silly mistakes and or being a bit reckless. I don't mind doing that. But the the problem is, I have absolutely zero understanding or knowledge of what I'm going into with this cave, with the with the lava cave. So, is that wolf still behind me? No. Okay. I have zero understanding of it. And so, I don't want there to be the possibility that I'm in the lava cave. 
uh, sort of looking around going, oh, this is cool. Uh, maybe I, I killed some rogues while I was down there and uh, all that kind of stuff and had a good time. And, and then next thing I know, I'm, I'm surrounded by rogues again. And yeah, it, I don't want to deal with two unknowns. I've got one unknown, <laughs> which is the layout of the land and what everything looks like and all that other business. Let's get this one. Um, right? But then knowing like that I can approach rogues, I can take them out and then know that they're not going to be there after I kill them. Uh, if, I, if I go down at midday, then halfway through the trip, I can do it because at night in the, the cave, it doesn't really change darkness, right? Um, not really. Not enough to worry about. And... Uh, Man, I'm definitely not getting as much scrap as I was hoping I would get. Oh, hey. Hey. Where are you? Oh, there you are. You, sir, are a two shotgun shell bear. There we go. Okay. Anyways, that's the reason why. I don't want to get down there. Halfway through the night, all of a sudden, uh, more rogues spawn in, and uh, bad things happen. This is this is what I'm, I don't want. So uh, I need to go in. This is to look at the caves. So I'm, I need to go in, sort of smart. Oh, good. Okay. The great thing about the climbing picks is you can get up a rock wall if you need to get to an ore. The bad thing about the climbing picks is that you have to let go of the climbing picks in order to pick. The ore, so I don't know how good it's going to be for that kind of solve, solving that specific problem. Unless you can climb up to somewhere that has a little ledge that you can stand on and then get at an ore. Uh, yeah, and then that then basically use the picks to get back out again. That makes sense, but if if it's on the side of a sheer cliff face that you can't get to unless you have picks on in, in your hand. Yeah, I don't think the I don't think they're gonna help you to get ores on uh, in certain inconvenient places. So there you go. So that's my reasoning. That's my thought process. It's why I'm uh, you know choosing to take the path that I'm taking. And uh, I think it makes sense um, for me. So moral of the story is we're gonna go into the cave tomorrow. I didn't do enough prep. I did not take into account the, uh, oh, hey, look at you. Oh, oh, wow. Or, <laughs> or amazing is absolutely or amazing. <laughs> there we go. And you're just, uh, you're just potassium, but that's okay. Nobody's complaining. You see this, like, I don't, I don't even know how I would get to that. Oh, 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 now this one though, I can do this and perfect. But that other one up there, I, I can't get it. I don't think I can get it because I could climb up to it. Oh, 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 that was a close, I could have broken my little feet. Let's see if we can get at it from the top. Oh, do I have, yes, I do. Oh, we're running out of daylight. Okay, let's uh, let's just do this real quick, and then we're gonna book it back home, and double check to make sure that we have everything we need. Wasn't it right here? Don't tell me that it despawned, or is it that it's just hard to see? Yeah, see, I don't think I can get at that. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Oh, look at this. Oh wow. Okay. Holy moly. <laughs> or amazing is or amazing. Oh, somebody asked me, is there an... So, okay, well, there's Orcastic, and uh, and then there's Ormazing. So this is Ormazing, and the one, the kind of the domey... Oh, my God. You see what I mean? Uh, and then the domey type thing that's over uh, that way. That right there. Okay. Uh, that is uh, Ortastic. And they were asking me, is there like an Ortastic or, or, or Amazing slash Ortastic in the new area? And the answer to that question is, I don't know. 
I do not know if there is. <laughs> and I have no idea. Oh my goodness. So, yeah. <laughs> We're going to have to see. We're going to have to see. Yep. That's, uh, I guess, a discovery that we'll, we'll make. We'll see if we find one. Um, yeah. There we go. All right. Let's just book it back. We might have to swim, actually. Because this daylight is going to disappear. And I need to get back to the base. Do my chores so that we can leave nice and early uh, the next day to get down into the cave and do our proper cave run. Yeah, see, we're losing light. All right, let's go. How much scrap did we get? Only four? You know what? That's four more scrap than we had before. Okay, let's just think about... We're going to swim back. And we'll think about it. Um, so I think we got everything we need in that box. I'm going to go back. We're going to take care of the animals. We're going to take care of the plants uh, overnight. And then we're going to... Uh, and then in the morning, we're going to head out. We're going to do the cave run. The standard cave run. I'm going to assume that the access to the lava cave is at the back end. That you have to go all the way through the, 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 the first cave to get to the to the point where you can go down into the lava cave. That's my assumption, okay? Am I right or wrong? I don't know. I'm just I'm just thinking if if I was cold games, that's how I would do it, right? So all the way but all the way to the back. Now maybe he switched it up a little bit. Then that would be kind of cool. But um yeah, I'm going to go all the way to the back, which hmm Yeah, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to see about the timing on this. Check out the lava cave, and then we're gonna come back, and we're gonna come back through this cave. We're not gonna go through the other cave. Now, the reason why we're not gonna go through the other cave is because I have no idea what the layout of that other cave is, and I need time to be able to learn that cave before I can try and uh, guarantee that I'm gonna be able to get from the lava cave to the out exterior and exit. I don't even know what the exit looks like. I don't know how it's shaped. I don't know anything about that cave. So uh, f figuring out how to get out of it, like think about it this way. If you'd never been in the cave on this side and you came down and you saw some pools and you'd like, I wonder how I get out. And then you realize like there's two little tunnels going out of one out of each pool. How would you, would you even know that there's, think that they join together? I, I don't know. <laughs> You'd have to assume that, right? Ooh. I think that that was a wolf. I think I saw a wolf in the lightning. That was cool. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I'm pushing it for time, I think. Um, might as well... Yeah, let's go up here. Do, 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 do. Is that a wolf? Yep, it's a crappy little level 2 wolf. All right. Let's grab that. And we'll grab that. Now, other than the... Okay, so we got 19 ores, because that's 27 plus 8. Uh, or 19 plus 8 is 27. We got uh, 8 potassium, 12 zinc, 15 uh, copper. Not bad for... Uh, uh, we didn't even... I didn't even try to get any ore. What's our power at? Uh, 30. Good, 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 good. We're maxed out almost. All right. Let's, uh... Let's load this up. Uh, we'll do iron and then we'll leave potassium. Okay, you, you, and you, you. And what else goes in here? Uh, feathers. Uh, this is easier. Dun, 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 dun. And, uh, dun. Oh! <laughs> Me and my, uh, grub blindness. <laughs> I always, I never see the grub. <laughs> oh, oh. Let's top up the fire. We, we're gonna let the fire go out anyways, but we might as well just, uh, and then we'll grab that because we're gonna use that on this. We can use uh, uh, as fertilizer. And, uh, you know what? We could cook up some uh, liver as a... Um, uh, we can burn those. Oh, no, actually. Do we have cooked food? We do not. Oh, we have one of you. 
and we'll eat that. Okay, and we'll put that away. So maybe we won't, uh, oh, I forgot to turn that one on. Uh, 38, and okay, that was, I wonder if he fixed that, the shift click into the, um, into the thingamabobber. Okay, we can take, uh, oh, we've got a full stack of 40, so we can't actually top that up. And, right, plants. Let's do plants. Do, 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 do. So the theory with the, why I needed to use the... Okay, don't, don't let that burn. Oh, okay. It was, it, I'd let my plant beds get, uh, 100, or like, all the way down. So the, oh, actually I should be, um, fertilizing. Uh, so yesterday when I needed three bottles or three thingamabobbers in order to uh, fully water them, it, that was why. Now, why it was that low, I don't know. Is it because I hadn't been, uh, hadn't done them for a while? Or is it because the, when I, when I did the update, it, it basically, oh, it, uh, it did that. Hang on a sec. Do that and that. Okay, let's get the, uh, steaks before they burn. Or the livers. Perfect. Okay. And grab some of you. Go feed the animals. Hey guys, how's it going? There we go. Alright, now. Hi guys. Tomorrow. Here. Tomorrow, I'm going into a lava cave. Alright. <clears throat> tomorrow I'm going into a lava cave and it's going to be scary but I they're not interested uh, fine fine I'm going to turn off the light I was going to tell you guys a story I heard you bear I don't care I was going to tell you a story but you're not interested they all they just walked away from me oh I should have really uh, refilled the water while I was over there let's do that right now Okay. Do, 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 do. Rest of these back in here. Should we, uh, no, 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 no. Let's not futz around with that. Uh, let's put you away in here and put away the extra. Uh, we can put that in there. We'll put that in there. And that and that. <clears throat> you can really tell that I've been not br uh, burning the, the fires as much as I usually do. Okay, get some light back. And we're going to grab all of our gear. Uh, I'm going to start off with the uh, these guys. Uh, then my climbing pick. We've got a couple of uh, pickaxes. So we've got the one pickaxe here. We're going to burn through that. Then we've got these two pickaxes. What I, you know what we need to find out, though, is we need to find out in the, uh, in the release notes, uh, the image showed Cold Games or the character opening up one of the crates in the lava area using a standard axe and not a pickaxe. So we need to figure out whether that is a thing or not. Okay. Um, the rest of this, I think, is fine. Now, somebody suggested that I uh, not take the uh, nine millimeter. And, oh man, no, nah, this'll, this'll survive. Do I need to repair these? Oh, I probably should. At least the double barrel. Uh, yeah, let's, let's do that. Uh, two, two, and two. Two, two, and two. And let's repair you, and maybe the nine mil. Two, two, and four. Wait a minute, was it board scrap? There goes the scrap that I just got yesterday. Uh, was it zinc? Yeah. One, two, three, four. Uh, I'm going to take the 9 mil because uh, I've got a crap ton of ammo for it. I've, put a, I put, I've got an upgrade on it. And I can actually um, I can use it for my day-to-day -day stuff. And then these are the heavy hitters. Uh, the other thing I could do is I could make uh, some more arrows. 
Uh, one, two, three, four, five. And we're going to grab ten of you. And five of you. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. And then finally, we're going to eat... Uh, we could take eggs, but I've got, like, a, a lot of protein bars. Um, no, we're not going to eat berries, except for we could eat the blueberries. But we're not going to eat berries because we can use them now to make jam. That was probably too much, but I'm not going to worry about it. There we go. Now, I'm still taking the berry water because it has uh, fruits and vegetable content in it. And so I think I can use that to augment this, the, my strawberry supply. So for food, I've got protein bars and strawberries. Plus, I've got the, uh, the uh, a combo water and vegetable from this. I've got the just the brute water here. So that's just so that I can, you know. And you can wash your hands with, uh, with, with the, uh, clear, these water bottles as well. Um, what else? I've got a... F yep, okay. I think we're good. There we go. All right. Now I'm ready to go. We've got everything we need. Uh, maybe what we could do is make a, uh, a, just a few more. What have we got? 70, we could do one, two, three. There we go. And we can put that back. Okay. And we'll have enough uh, shotgun shells and arrows and stuff like that. All right, in the next one, we're going to actually just immediately head out and go to the cave. Ah, it's exciting. I'm very excited. I'm, I'm looking forward to this. All right, thank you very much, everyone. Until next time. You all have yourselves a great day. Bye-bye.